Okay, one of the things that's really important with Inventor and keeping your life simple and helping you find your work and keep track of what you're doing is knowing where you're saving your files and having logical names for your files. First and foremost, everything needs to be saved to OneDrive. Then secondly, you need to be using projects um, in Inventor so that your files with each particular project stay together. If you have not been doing that, you need to start now. So the first thing you should probably do is um, go to your OneDrive, which hopefully you have sunk with your computer, and um, create a folder for IED. And um, I have a folder for my Inventor work. And I keep all of my IED stuff in this folder, and my Inventor work I put into here. And then for each project, I create a folder for. If you notice on Canvas, we are organizing Canvas by um, new project folders. So you should be able to keep track of where everything is. Okay, as you can see, I've already done that for the Automata. If you hadn't done that, you need to do so. Um, and then you can take wherever your files are and just drag them and drop them into this file. Now, we're going to use Inventor to create this file right here. And what makes this file special is this .ipj. This is your project file and you can sort of think of it as directions. It lets Inventor know that when you're working within this project, everything you're doing gets dumped into this folder. So how you set that up is you go over here to Inventor and I already have it but your default is right here to default and default is not where you want to be. So you click on projects and if you don't have one yet you hit new single user um, and you put in your project name and if you notice it's creating this pathway right here automatically. Now the problem is, is it defaults to save into documents, which ties you to a particular computer. That is no good. So what you need to do is browse and find your OneDrive and find that folder you created. Um, and there we go. Boom. And you hit OK and it puts it in there. Now, I already have that, so I'm going to hit cancel, but if you don't have that, you would hit finish. Now, let's say you have a project file, but you've changed to a different computer, and it's not showing up here on the default. You simply go over here to the projects again, but instead of hitting new, you hit browse, and you search for that file, which will be on your OneDrive, in your Inventor folder, in Inventor Work, and it's right there. And then it pops up checked. Um, if you want to change between your projects you're doing, so for example, if I wanted to hop back over to the toy project I was doing, I would just check there. If I'm working with this one, I would just check here. Now what this does is every time I hit save, it automatically saves everything to that one folder, which is very useful for a lot of the things we're getting ready to do as we move forward.